Roger, uh, great playing, uh, 64 today, following a 64 yesterday. Uh, what's been working so well for you the last two rounds? I think uh, I think in the first round, I, I dusted off a few of those jitters, um, and then I was just able to settle in uh, the last few holes on Thursday. And uh, you know, I really like this golf course. I like a lot of the sight lines off the tee. I mean, these greens are so good. You just put the ball in line, it's going to go in the hole. So, um, you know, I just plot my way around this golf course. Uh, it, it's, it's a great track. And how important a round was this for you, knowing coming into the week just outside that top 125, and how big a round is tomorrow going to be? I mean, I'll let you guys kind of figure that out. As far as I'm concerned, you know, there's a trophy to be won, and, and everything will kind of take care of itself. Um, question about the heat. When it's really, really hot like this. Sorry, what? The heat? Okay, yeah. Yeah, do you do anything differently when you're out on a day like this where you know it's going to be a little bit brutal? Um, you know, yeah, sometimes I'll hydrate a little bit differently. You know, I like a little BioSteel. It's like just a, you know, supplement that you just put in your drink. Helps, you know, replace some electrolytes. For me, it's really a, uh, away from the course, you know, so when I go home tonight, drinking a lot of water, really hydrating myself, recovering so that I have enough energy for tomorrow. Um, and d did you do that for today? I mean, had yeah. you hydrated? Yeah. yeah. You know, if you, thinking back on your career, is there any round or any place you could say this is the hottest conditions I've ever played in? We've played in some really hot places. I think when the Barbasol used to be played in Alabama, okay. that was like playing on the surface of the sun. <laughs> Uh, this is always a hot week, uh, you know, just with the humidity. Yeah. Um, yeah, it's just, it comes and goes with the heat waves. Last one, I, obviously you did well today. Do you consider yourself a good heat player? I'd like to think so. I grew up in the dry heat of British Columbia. You know, I live in Houston now, so this is really like my backyard playing in this type of condition. So, uh, you know, I think I've climatized well to this. Cool, thank you. Yeah.